Greetings, ladies and gentlemen, and anybody who doesn't fit in that description. Happy Pride Month. That's what I believe it is, anyway. Um, I've never really been clear on what month is what celebration of any kind, really. Anyway, when I found out it was Pride Month, I decided I wanted to do something to celebrate to support that. I don't know. And I considered drawing a couple of my characters like I did with Severa and Mira, Mia, but I didn't really feel the motivation to do that. So instead, I decided to draw a couple of YouTubers that I found very recently and who I absolutely adore. The channel is named Wyo Russ or Wyoming Russell, I believe, one of the guy's name, plus the state. Anyway, <laughs> uh, I absolutely love them. They're two guys, and I believe their names are Dylan and Chris, and they're, they are just so, they're just so sweet, really. <laughs> I like their personalities and how nice they are in all their React videos, and just I like their, their outro and everything and how real they are. They're just so sweet, and I love watching their videos. I literally cannot watch any of their videos without smiling. I'll just notice I'm smiling like halfway through. I just love them so much. And I really hope they see this, and if they do, I hope they enjoy it. If not, then I'm sorry. I'm sorry for the pain. For the pain I have caused. Okay, um, yeah, I, I had a lot of struggles. <laughs> I wanted to try to do, um, realism, but I haven't ever tried realism digitally, and I got close, but definitely not there, exactly. One day, though, with practice, I'm sure I'll get there. In any case... The final product is kind of painterly, I guess. But, you know, it's... Uh, there are some things I like about the final product, and some things that I obviously don't. But, you know, maybe one day I'll try it again. And I'll, whatever I will have learned by then will be enough to make me like every little bit. Uh... I kind of wanted to do this without having any lines visible, but I also really like when lines are present and kind of give contrast between certain certain aspects of the drawing, and because of that, it's kind of difficult for me to do, uh, like, legit realism, because... Aside from really small hairs, like eyelashes and whatnot, lines don't exactly exist in real life. So, yeah. Trying to do a bit of realism was a bit of an interesting thing, but I kept in mind something I learned from uh, the Keenan Lafferty show? I don't know. Kay and Kella... Okay, I'm trying. English is not my best subject, apparently. <laughs> it used to be. <laughs> um, uh, KNKL show. I don't... It's been a while since I watched one of those videos. But anyway, uh, overpainting is what he called it. When you go on top of all your layers and just add the details and the shading and the, all the fancy stuff. So I started doing that. I kind of like that method. It gave a nice effect. It came... Very close to realism. Of course, it didn't get that close. Because, yeah. Anyway. <laughs> um, there are definitely some things that I probably should practice on uh, with this method, this technique, this something. I don't know. For example, there's the line thing that I just explained. There's also... Playing with hands, I didn't actually 
aside from looking at the, any possible um, characteristics that are unique to their, their hands that they use in their sign out, I don't, I didn't use a reference for their hands. I just kind of winged it with the shading because the flat color wasn't enough. So I picked colors from their face and neck and in Dylan's case, his shoulders as well. And use those colors to shade the hands. And I, I kind of like how the hands went. Not entirely sure how to go about fingernails because the fingernails don't look quite right to me. That's something to practice another day. I was having a lot of problems with my tablet, my my drawing tablet. Because a lot of the times when I would make a mark, the little the nib would do something weird. I don't know how to I don't know if it was my computer, the tablet itself, or the pen. Regardless, whenever I made a mark, a lot of times the mark would just suddenly like zigzag around and that was very frustrating. So I had to use the undo key a lot to fix that and I also had to cover up some of those random marks that I hadn't noticed before. I, that I'm glad I noticed before I posted this. I hope I noticed them all. If I didn't notice them all, then... Uh, Oops. I tried. I don't know. I hope this is just a kink, like a temporary thing with my tablet. If it isn't, then I'm going to have to be... I'm going to have to attempt doing some, like, commissions or maybe finally opening up Patreon or something in order to get a new one, because I don't want to have to ask my mom to pay for it, because, you know, I want to be an artist. I want to be a professional artist, and if I'm not that, then fine, I hope I can choose something else, but whatever I do end up doing, I don't want to be dependent on my mom forever. So, ideally, I would be able to at least pay for some high price things now. So, you know, just, I'm, I'm practicing being an adult. <laughs> I'm, I'm trying. I should have the, um, English is failing me again. Um, I should have a, a grip, a grip on it somewhat by now, but I, I'm still not quite there. Um, maybe one day? Anyway, um, I don't know what it is, I, but something about the end product of, um, Dylan yeah, I think Dylan's face just doesn't look quite right to me. Maybe the eyes are a little too high or the the cheeks are a little too round. Not round. Maybe the, the um, cheekbones are too big, maybe. I don't know. I love his cheekbones, though. His cheekbones are just... Yeah, wow. Um... They both actually look really attractive. Maybe that's part of the reason why I like them so much. Is it's easier to watch people who you find attractive. And I'm try not trying to... That's not... I don't... I hope that doesn't sound like rude or mean or anything. It's just a personal preference that I believe everyone has. Some people are going to look more attractive to you. And the ones that do look more attractive are easier to look at. So you'll probably be more likely to watch them if they have a YouTube channel in this uh, case. Yeah, in this case. So, um, yeah. Any, anyway. Um, oh, if it wasn't implied earlier and nobody watching this knows already, they are actually a couple. That's that's why I'm... That, well, one of the reasons... That's one of the reasons why I'm drawing, painting something in them for Pride Month, and I, li I like them. I like them a lot. I feel like they have, a, like, a really good relationship just because of how they present themselves in the videos. Oh, um, one thing I'm about to get to here in a second. 
is like one of the things I want to learn, practice, whatever drawing is. Um, you know, like when 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 hairstyles have a bit of shaved hair on the side, I want I want to practice drawing that because I I like those hairstyles. But whenever I look at that, I'm like, how do I convey that without it looking weird? Well, that's how I am with most things. So, you know, practice and you get more confident. Maybe I'm never confident. <laughs> Truly never confident, but I try. Fake it till you make it. It works. I swear it does. Just pretend you're confident, and you'll get there. Um, I still have a few minutes left to speak about things that I don't know about. Um, um, hmm. I do have more ideas. Like, uh, I started a bullet journal a few a few days ago. I think I'm losing track of the days like I always do. Um, and I I started a um, a video log so I can keep track of the ideas I've had in my head without forgetting them because I have an awful memory. I forget everything. I swear I'd forget my own name if I, if actually I don't know how I still remember my own name. It's 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 a puzzling. It's an enigma. That's, I don't know. Anyway, um, I'm trying. <laughs> it's it's really late in the, well, early? Late? And it's like almost 3 a.m. when I'm recording this. So I'm a little, a little weird right now. I need to, I need to, to, um, figure out how to get videos done faster and more um reliably i guess like post on the same days when i was still in, in class in semester during the semester i was doing pretty good with keeping the videos being posted on the same days every week that being thursday i chose thursday for myself and I kept with it for a while, but then suddenly summer happened, and I think for a couple of weeks it was still Thursday, but then it started leaking into, like, Friday and Saturday and then Sunday, etc. I haven't technically missed a week yet, I've just... they were... they were late. By several days. Oops. I'm trying, I promise. Um, I kind of, I've, I haven't shown my face yet in a video, and I was kind of wanting to wait for, um, when I have more subscribers to do so, that's kind of like a big, hey, you guys already like me, so this is my face kind of thing, but I feel like maybe... Helping with my own self-esteem could it could it could go a lot smoother if maybe I go ahead and start out with showing my face. I just it's it's a whole process trying to get over the the fear and the anxiety about that. So uh, yeah. Anyway, I just wanted to. Um, I just wanted to do this drawing because I really like these two guys, and I haven't seen a whole lot of their videos, but the ones I have seen I do enjoy, and they're very inspirational in their own way, so, yeah. Um, I'm not sure what else to say about them, it's just that I like them. I really do hope they see this, though, because even though I don't have a whole lot to say, I, I really would like to, to um, express to them about how great they are, and how inspiring they, they are to me. They just, I like how they just seem to be so real in themselves, and they have no fear about being that. And it's so easy for anyone to put them down. That's just a fear 
I have to get over myself, I guess. So I like watching people who have already done it or never needed to do it in the first place. Because I don't know. I don't know if they had to struggle with their own self-esteem or if they if they're perfectly fine. Like if they perfectly fine with how they looked and how they are and everything. I don't know that. They know that, but unless unless I've seen a video in which they talk about it and I haven't, then I, I, don't, I don't know. So. Another thing is I need to practice. I need to not exactly practice. I need to get in the habit of signing my dating it but i guess digital stuff doesn't need to be dated anyway um thanks for watching subscribe if you want and like and share and comment all that fancy youtube stuff um thanks for watching have a nice day or week or month or year i guess bye